sunset of Burning Man 2016 and you can see the sun is setting in the Nevada desert here. Burning Man is the annual festival where people come together and camp in the desert in RVs and tents. This is our camp down here. I'm sharing with about six other people. That's the van I'm sleeping in. I'm sleeping in that van very th there in the back. I've got a blow up mattress and a sleeping bag. Whoop, oh, that one there. I think it's about 70,000 people come here for about about a week and a half. And there's a combination, you can see in my hair, I've got like dust and like ugh, and sand. But it's super fun. You go, you meet cool people. And this is a beautiful time of the day because you can see the colors. There's some people up there uh, getting a good view of the sunset. There's Ty, that's my mate Ty Neve. Where are you, Ty? Are you going for a ride? Yeah, sunset ride. Epic. Where are you going to go? To where? Mines of Madness and Fire. I see. So Ty's going to go and uh, check out the sunset a little bit more. Get a view over here. You got lots of countries represented. You got the uh, the UK flag there and the Scottish flag. You got the American flag. You got California. You've got uh, Canadian flag over there. Check out the view over there. Actually, isn't that beautiful? So yeah, everyone here is very, very open and friendly. Like there's no cash or there's no, nothing can be bought here. So you have to come to the playa with lots of food and then and drinks and gifts. And then it's like an exchange. So for example, we have a coffee cart. So we, we pack up a coffee cart in here each day and we uh, ride out onto the desert into the playa and, and we give away free coffee with tequila and vodka. Um, We've got bottles of tequila and vodka, and people come up and say, "Oh yeah, I'll have some coffee, I'll have some te tequila, vodka," and we give them shots out there on the plier. And there's no, they don't pay us for it; we just give it to them. And they say thank you, and they give us a big hug, and then they move on. And then yesterday, I got like a couple of hot dogs out on the plier. People were just giving them away. There were cupcakes, uh, and it's fun. It's fun as hell. But it just reminds me. Um, what well, does it remind me? But it's just a great lesson in uh, getting out of our societal constraints, these barriers that we uh, we put in front of ourselves and conformity, like we're in there, in the modern world we're conforming to everything, like if you've got a job, you go in, you wear a suit and a tie or a certain attire and you say the right thing or you don't say the right thing here, it's very much encouraged that people just express themselves and, and do what they want, say what they want, be who they want to be and so people dress up in peculiar outfits and everyone's just like yes nice no one's looking at me going oh that's weird everyone's just like yes celebrating people's individuality so I'm wearing a little bit of a I mean I'm pretty conservative to be, to be fair uh, <laughs> but you see all kinds of strange attire here so it happens every uh, let's see every the last week of August every single year started 30 years ago in 1986 started in uh, outside of San Francisco and then moved here I think in year 10 maybe year 8 9 or 10 and it's been here ever since and it's just gradually built 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 more people come and I think it was 70,000 this year so here's some people riding bikes there's some fire you can just see starting to there we go the dragon with some fire over there Ooh, look at the colors of the sky now isn't that beautiful And now you can start to hear the music start to pick up and all the parties start to take place. Here's a friend of mine, Rachel, who's coming coming back in that group right there. Rachel! Chelsea! Kara! Say hello to YouTube. People loving people. So there you go, Burning Man 2016. There's some more shenanigans going on. And we're just getting ready for the night and we're going to go out and then, you know, you party until dawn. 
till sunrise and you can stay up and watch the sunrise. So right now watching the sunset, later on, if I can push through. Last night I stopped at 4.30, that was enough for me. Uh, if we can push through to about 5.45, you get to capture the sunrise. I like to go to bed a little bit earlier though, otherwise if I stay up to like 6.45, 7 or 8, my whole day is a write-off. And I like to just appreciate the sunset. So it was nice to share this with you. TN. Rachel. Yeah, I am filming you, yes. She loves it. <laughs> All right, from Burning Man 2016. Catch you on the next one. So I'm at Burning Man and we've got a battle between the carrots who want to protect the carrots and the bunnies who are surging towards the wall. They're building